Alrighty, I had to do one last update for you guys before I head out on my trip to Dollywood and Carowinds this week. I will be back Sunday. Um, so we'll start the updates again. Craiga is going to be out flying for me. Thank you to Craiga for doing that. Um, but unfortunately, we missed testing today by just a little bit. Craiga got to see it in person, but the drone wasn't up in time. The holding brake is being used for testing now, and the MCBR is not stopping the train. So it will be continuously testing from now on. Um, they'll be trying to get as many cycles as possible. They were transferring on and off trains from what we could tell. Um, and in this footage, you can actually see them moving off a train, I believe, if I'm correct. I'm not going to promise, but from what I've been told and from what I see, I think you can see a train being uh, taken off the track via transfer track. Now, if you're looking closely, you're already noticing that Frontier Canada buildings are going up. Yes, that's exciting. So we are seeing theming and buildings being built around Frontier Canada. You can actually see one. Um, from the second drop to that little airtime hill before the helix. If you look closely, I have a zoomed in photo coming up as well. Um, and the station still looks the same. No theming going on there. I think uh, they're focusing on either the other theming or they're waiting for the roofing to come. Um, I have a feeling it's going to be dark wood and um, some metal. I, I think it's going to be metal. Um, other than that, I don't really know. It isn't too similar to the animation, so it is hard to predict. Um, it does look like they're installing LED lighting on the MCBR, the top of the lift, and the lift hill. Again, we are really far back. It looks a lot closer um, to you guys as viewers, but we are really far back. We're back in a field, so sometimes making out what they're doing is extremely difficult. So sometimes we are going to make mistakes on our predictions. Now, what is super cool is they are working on the, um, uh, in the Kingswood area. It looks like they, and I can't guarantee this either. Again, we don't go on property to film. We're always in the field area, but it looks like they tore down the washrooms in the Kingswood area and there's a new building going up and then there's some bulldozing. I saw an excavator in yesterday's footage or the day before, I forget which day it was, but we did see an excavator digging. So it'll be very interesting to see what's going on there. Now, again, it could just be a Halloween haunt building. It could be new restrooms because they, again, it looks like they may have torn down the other ones, but it's difficult to see from this far back. Um, but yeah, it's it, there's some things going on in Kingswood and hopefully it's uh, some cool stuff. Maybe a new restaurant or maybe just a Halloween haunt building or maybe just new washrooms. It's going to be one of those three, I think. It's not going to be anything too exciting yet. Um, but yeah, I don't know if there's anything else to report on. There's no work going on on Mindbuster. They're building some weird contraption in Backlot's queue. It looks like either a generator um, or a fun picks building. I have no idea yet. So we'll wait and see what's going on there. The pathway from Frontier Canada over to Behemoth, Yukon over to Behemoth, is almost complete. They're just going to lay down the bricks. Um, and on that, no other rides have been testing, just Yukon so far. Um, and yeah, super exciting. So uh, hopefully you guys enjoyed this really quick update. Um, I'll try and get updates on, um, out for you guys while I'm on my vacation. It's not really a vacation. It's more like a business trip. Um, I am bringing my laptop and all my equipment, so I will be able to make videos for you guys. Um, but we are going to be focusing on filming at Dollywood because Dollywood's giving us an amazing opportunity and I couldn't be more excited. Um, so thanks for watching, guys. Don't forget to hit that like button, subscribe if you haven't, and share this video for others to enjoy. Have a good one, guys. Bye.